Hi guys, it's Liz and welcome back to my channel. And today we are going to be unboxing BoxyCharm for September. So stay tuned. So I got my BoxyCharm in the mail for this month. I'm still waiting for my BoxyCharm for last month that I ordered at the end of the month. It still hasn't come. No shipping. I cannot figure out how to get a hold of BoxyCharm. I have sent them email, but then it got pushed back saying that um, their email is no good no more. I try to use the bot. I don't know. I'm getting annoyed with it. But anyways, BoxyCharm, this is the base box. Um, this is $25 a month. There's three tiers to BoxyCharm. They also have BoxyCharm Premium, which is $35, and BoxyCharm Lux, which is $49 a month. So let's get into this, because I can't wait. So scissors, 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 haha. -ha. So let's open it up. Okay, open. And this is what it looks like when you get in. So this month is Glam Vibes Only, and I have number 106 right there in the corner. So let's see. So the first thing I see are these Glam in Paradise Gold Foiled Masks infused with Cannabis Sata Seed Oil. Get into a state of bliss with cannabis. Meet Glam in Paradise Cannabis Stavia. Your new glam and chill skincare routines. These gold field leopard pattern shoots masks are infused with cannabis. Sativa seed oil and designed to deliver total skin satisfaction. Instant early selfies. And this MSRP is for $18. So let me see how many you get in this hat because I have no clue. So. Okay, so you get one for your eyes. One for your lips and one for your face i'm actually looking forward to using these i might actually use these tonight so definitely like that see next i have the see this is the evening glamour blink limited edition palette i was so hoping i would get the alamere purple palette i have been eyeballing that palette forever because her other palette is right here I got this in a boxy charm. Oh my gosh, I think two years ago. And this is still one of my favorite palettes I have ever received. And I was so hoping to get the other one, but I didn't. So I'm going to have to just bite the bullet and buy it myself. But this one, let's see what this one looks like. Eh, it's okay. It's not the best palette I've ever seen. Um, let's see, where is this? A perfectly compact eye and blush palette with six highly pigmented shadows and two blusher shades to help you achieve that evening glamour look. And this MSRP is for $26. So let's do some testeroos. Uh, it feels dry. Very, very, very dry. So let's see. And there you go. I don't know if you guys can see it. I really wish that I didn't test this because I'm not impressed at all. So let's see these blushes. Eh, that one's not too bad. And those aren't too bad. But yeah, I'm not, I do not think it's worth the $26. I think it's just going to sit in my collection and I'm never going to use it. So next we have, let me see, the Levito nurging 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 next we have the levita nurging hand cream right there and this is a area prone to environmental damage this hand cream in this sweet earthy scent of patchouli and vanilla is rich in organic shea butter and plant-based hydrochloric acid helping to soothe soften and protect hands from environmental damage dryness and chafing and this msrp is for 14 dollars so let's remove the safety seal. It does smell good. It's really nice on the skin though. It is nice, but eh, it's just a hand cream. So see, this is what I'm excited for. This is the Pharmacy Cheer Up. Brightening Vitamin C Eye Cream with Axillary Cherry. 
Next we have the Pharmacy Cheer Up Brightening Vitamin C Eye Cream with Cherries, a super hydrating vitamin C eye cream rich that brightens and helps reduce the appearance of fine lines and dark circles, deliv delivers instant radiate radiance to the eye area. Clean fragrance free formula. And this MSRP is for $45. Okay, that's definitely worth the box. I love pharmacy stuff too, so much. And this is what it looks like. I remove the safety seal. Oh, it smells really good too. And there's what it looks like inside the pot. I'm definitely excited to use this because I love skincare. I, during this whole coronavirus, skincare, skincare, skincare. I love it so much. I need to make a video on what I've been using for skincare lately because I'm absolutely in love with it. And the next thing we got was some Huda Beauty. We got the Huda Beauty Matte and Metal. Um, a dual ended liquid eyeshadow combining a rich, vaulty matte formula on one side and a over the top sparkle on the other. And this MSRP is for $25. See, let's open this up. What color did I get? I got Shimmering Sunset. Oh, it's really pretty too. Look at that. So let's do a little swatch -roo. So first you would put the matte side on your lids. See, isn't that pretty? It's right here. That is very pretty. I like that. So you would take this and just pat it on your lid. And then you would take the shimmer side and put a little bit on there and pat that down on top of it. And there you go. That is gorgeous. I love that. And there it is on my finger. So that and then you would just pat that on top of that. Oh, that is so pretty. I cannot wait to use this. So that is everything we got in this month's box. I'm not. Eh, I'm okay with it. I'm like, eh, I love this and I love this. That's about all I like in the whole box. But these two items alone were worth the value of the box. This um, eyeshadow palette, I will pass this on to somebody else. And we got the hand cream. And we got the sheet mask, which I will use. But these are just a one-time thing and I kind of wish it was something else. So let's just look at the value of this box and see how much it was for the month. So we have the pharmacy for $45. We have the eyeshadow palette for $26, which is way too much money for that. We have the Huda Beauty for $25. We have the hand cream for $14. And then we have the, the three-piece mask for $18 equals $128. So you're definitely getting your money out of the box, but like I said, some of it in there, I just don't think it's worth it. And it's not worth the money that you, um, some of it, I just don't think it's worth it. I kind of wish I really would have got that Alamar palette, but that's the way it goes. So, and maybe they'll sneak it in my BoxyCharm Premium. Fingers crossed, because I really, really, really want it. But I hope you guys like this video. I hope you guys will subscribe to my channel and ring the bell so you'll be notified every single time that I upload a new video. I hope you guys have a wonderful and a magical day, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.